Bonjour, friends, and happy French Friday to you. Today's video is sponsored by New Air. We're so excited to unbox and put together our New Air 26 inch misting fan for the outdoors. And uh, you can also use this without the mister. I just want to add that if you just want the fan without the misting. So let's go ahead and uh, get this thing unboxed. Mr. French Farmhouse Flair is going to do the unboxing for me, uh, AKA my hubby. He will also be assembling this for us today. Turn this fan on now. It's got three different speeds as well as oscillating. You can lock it in a position in the back if you don't want it to oscillate. And out on the patio, you want the airflow, so the oscillating is a really nice feature. We'll turn it up to next speed. Nice, puts on some serious air. Now we're going to flip on the mister. There it goes. You can see it coming out. This is a side angle here. You just have a, an adjustment to adjust how much seat, how much you have coming out. You can you can tie it, have it just gentle, or, or you can have it. Just, I don't. Know. Okay, I was showing the little knob where you adjust it, Robbie. Yeah. Show it again, or so I can video. You can have it lightly misting. Heavier mess. So that little control right there controls the misting. I love the wheels here on the bottom. It makes it so easy to be able to move it around wherever we need it. And then the handle here as well just makes it so easy to move it into a different position. This new misting fan by New Air is going to be an awesome addition to our backyard. Penny and I are going to spend many hours out here enjoying it, being nice and cool here in Southern California. We'd like to thank New Air for uh, letting us demonstrate their product and like to tell all of you out there at home, go check out their website. They've got these great misting fans and other products. 
they can make a great addition to your backyard no matter where you live in the country or in the world new air has a product that will make your outdoor time way more enjoyable okay now let's get into the dining room refresh part of this video I picked up this hanging candelabra at my local antique store and I want to give it a little makeover. I'll be using this Rust-Oleum metallic brilliant metal finish in this antique gold color. In our new home, there was no hanging chandelier in the center. There was just these two can lights, so we really wanted a chandelier of some sort, and so we went with a candelabra. I'm really happy with how this candelabra turned out, and I love the roses on the candelabra. And I also added these clear crystals that I found for only a dollar each at an antique store, and I think it adds a lot of character. I also purchased these battery operated candles at an antique store. They came with this remote that has a timer. I love the realistic looking flickering flame on these taper candles. Some of you might remember this table. It was in my office area in our last home. I would use it for doing crafts, wrapping gifts on it, etc. My parents built this table for us when we were first married and we had no furniture at the time. So this table means so much to us and especially now since my dad is no longer with us anymore. I love this old antique pine wood that my parents used to build the table with. But over the years, for some reason, um, they only used clear sealer on it, but it had turned an orange color. And so we've sanded completely down and we're ready to restain now. As you can see, I'm catching the edges here so that make sure that I don't have any drips along the sides here. And also just want to get that clear coat on there uh, really good as well so that uh, we have a nice finish all around on the top and on all the four sides of the table. After applying this first coat, I ended up applying three more coats after, so a total of four coats of uh, clear sealer on the table. I'm really happy with how this turned out.
Now for decorating the top of the table, I want to start off using this French grain sack table runner. Next I'll be adding this French turntable. Love the cute little roosters on this. Now I want to add this blue Bella mason jar that my mom gave me with these beautiful faux flowers and berries. Next I want to add this cute little red bucket. It's wooden and then it has a metal handle on it. And then I've already put a faux Ikea plant inside. Now I'm going to be adding my napkin holder on the table here and I just want to keep this simple so I'm not adding too much. Okay friends, thank you so much for watching today's video and a thank you to my hubby who helped with this video today and also I want to thank New Air for sponsoring today's video and I will leave a link uh, in the description box below so go check out uh, the products that they have to offer and they have more than just the New Air fans so go check it out, you won't be disappointed. And uh, I absolutely love our new fan. And I so wish that we would have had this fan when we lived in Southern Louisiana. We could have enjoyed the outdoors so much more than what we did when we lived there if we would have had this out on our back patio. So uh, no matter where you put it uh, outdoors, this fan is awesome. And if you live anywhere in the South, you especially need this. Uh, even if you live in the West, where it's more of a dry climate. It is uh, so helpful in these hot summer months. So no matter where you live, if it's hot where you are in the summertime, you need this fan and you will love it. So go check it out and I will see you in the next one, friends. Until then, au revoir.